Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today this is a video that is by request by one of my lovely viewers. She wanted me to do a tutorial for the lips and uh, she wanted me to show maybe some tips and tricks on how to keep your lips from feathering. So as you get older and you laugh and smile and pucker, those kinds of things, they can cause lip lines. Uh, little tiny wrinkles in your lip line area. So what I'm going to show you today is a little tip that I picked up along the way of, you know, doing research, um, checking out new products and stuff like that. So it's really beneficial to you um, that I share this information if you have the feathering lip issue. So the products that I'm going to be using today are um, First off, the lipstick that I'm going to be using is a liquid lip, and this is by Kylie, and this is in the color Coco K. If you have been following my channel and you watch my videos, then you know I've already done a uh, top five favorite lipsticks, and this is in that top five. So I'm going to be using this today. I will link that video somewhere. I think it's on this side. I forget which side it pops up on, but I think the card will pop up on this side right here. So I'll link that right now. And then uh, I'm also going to be using the lip liner that came with the lipstick. So yeah, um, the helpful tool, and I call this a tool because that's exactly what it is. It helps to keep your lips from feathering or bleeding. So this is a product by No Cosmetics, K-N-O-W, and they are based out of Canada. And they're, it's really good, this product that I, I'm about to show you. It um, has, it's paraben free, it's, um, it has, you know, it's animal uh, cruelty free, it's not tested on animals, and I believe that it has, um, vitamin E and stuff like that in it as well so um, this is the product if you can see that and it's just a it looks like a white crayon or a white liner that's all it is but it's like a wax um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to zoom you in to my lips and then I will show you how to apply this as well as the lip products so that you don't get feathering Okay, so you're going to take the lip liner and you're going to apply it on the outside of your lip line. I go just right on the outside of my lip line and then inward to my actual lip line. So we're going to go ahead and do that. And you don't have to be precise with this. Um, you just want to get a good coat on your lip line area or right above it. And then I go over it one more time just to make sure that I got every, every area. And like me, I know my problem spots. So like on this side right here, it tends to feather more than this side. So I try to get that area really, really well. Okay, so now that that's done, I'm gonna grab my lip liner and we're going to line our lips. This is a very neutral, nudie color. I really love it. Okay. I like to make like an X, like right at the Cupid's bow. 
um, just to give me that little lift right there in that area. Make sure that they're both even. And once you have them lined, then you can apply your liquid lip. Um, a lot of times I don't really have issues with the liquid lip bleeding per se, but some of your creamier lipsticks will bleed a lot worse. But this stuff helps either way. I'm only using this, this uh, liquid lip by Kylie today because I'm about to go out and this is the color that I wanted to wear. So. And you can always apply a lip topper to whatever color you use, but today I'm going to keep it simple. And some of you might like to go on the outside of your lips quite a bit to make your lips look more fuller. And that's fine too. This uh, No Bleeding Lips works for that as well. ELF also makes one that's for um, that as well. It's like a, it's a big chunky uh, liner and I think you can use it on your whole lip. And then once you put it on, it kind of seals everything in. So that's a good product if you want to try that out. Um, I'm going to move in just a little closer because that's as far as my camera will zoom just so you guys can see. It really does give a nice finished look to the lips and so you don't have to worry about the feathering or it bleeding off into other areas of your face. It's just really, really nice to have. Um, you can pick one of these up, the No Bleeding Lips at Sephora. They sell for $15. I'll put a link in the description box below so that you can click on that. Yeah, so I don't really have a discount code for you guys, but I will link um, in the description bar below the information where you can purchase the No Bleeding Lips product because it's really awesome. And especially if you have issues like I do with the little lip, uh, lip lines there. So um, it's around $15 at Sephora. So if you'd like to go pick up one or order it online, you can do that. I believe Ulta may carry them as well. And then you can always get the much cheaper brand at Walmart sold by e.l.f. I think it's around $4 for that one, but it's a big chunky one. It's not a thin one like the one that I showed you. So yeah. Well, that's the video for today. Thank you for joining me. And um, I wanted to let you guys know that I'm going to set a schedule of um, videos. I'm going to be posting uh, Monday mornings around 7 a.m. And then I will post again on Tuesday mornings around 7 a.m. Tuesdays will be um, Tutorial Tuesday. So I'm going to do tutorials on Tuesday like today. So this is the first in that series. And then I will post again towards the end of the week on Thursday and Friday. And then that way, so that'll be four times a week, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. I'm really going to work hard, you guys, to maintain that schedule. Now, there may be some weeks where I can only hit you up on Monday, Tuesday, and Friday or something like that. I may have to miss Thursday. It just depends on... Uh, my schedule, I still work a full-time job, which is 40 to 60 hours a week. And then I have things around the house I have to take care of as well. So I only have a very short window to record. Usually it's late at night on Friday night or early Saturday morning. And then the rest of my weekend's kind of taken up with family, um, cleaning, that kind of thing. So, you know, life must go on, right? But I will um, stick to at least... Monday, Tuesdays, and Fridays for sure, for sure. And uh, every now and then you'll get an extra Thursday uh, post or whatever. So I hope you guys enjoy my videos. If you have any questions, comments, suggestions, or requests, leave them down below. And if you haven't done so already, please hit that subscribe button and ring that bell so that you get my notifications. Thank you all. Have a great day. Love you. Mwah.